One of the things I wanted to ask is that, uh, I mean, you see Adelaide's role in helping Josh Giddy and Terence Ferguson reach the NBA uh, mm. and they're very successful with Kai going undrafted and Mojave seemingly dropped off a, a number of radars. I'm keen to get your thoughts, not particularly on those players per se, but just the idea that a, a roster built to help younger talent get drafted versus a roster built to win a championship. Do these two things oppose each other? Uh, when you say it like that, it, it does. <laughs> okay. It, it obviously, uh, I think uh, New Zealand's, uh, the way that they went this past year, I mean, a, a lot of things didn't go well for them during COVID, um, being stuck again in, in Australia and having the, the roster that they have and not being healthy uh, throughout the year. And um, But they, their young kids all seem to get, get drafted uh, that were there. So, I mean, that worked for them, but they didn't make the playoffs. Mm. Uh, and, um, you know, with RJ Hampton, they didn't make the... Lamello the, Ball the, was a similar situation too, right? When Mello was um, in Illawarra, they didn't make the playoffs. I mean, it's a bit, there's you, you can look at it to a different ways, and but you've got to have an opportunity for the kid to play. Uh, if you're going to have a next star, you want to have a, a great opportunity for him to be successful and help your team grow and for him to be for him to shine and show his skill set so that way that's the reason why he he's ultimately chose to to be with your program that you you'll get to play with grown men play in a professional league that's one of the sec- second best league in the world and um outside of the NBA and then you're looking at how how does this benefit me um and everyone watching from afar uh, in the NBA and that come this way and see it they already know uh how, Australia's competitiveness, their edge um, from the guys that they've seen at the, not only the World Cup, the Olympics, and from the Centre of Excellence, from our junior kids, uh, for the kids that we have in college today. Another quick pause for the 